Hi student, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to prove by mathematical induction n cube minus n is divisible by 6. Let's take this expression as p of n, that is n cube minus n. We are going to find what is p of 1. 1 cube minus 1, which is 1 minus 1, and it is 0. We can say it is divisible by 6, which is divisible by 6 because 0 is divisible by any number. Now assume p of k is true. So assume p of k is true. So p of k expression is k cube minus k. Since it is divisible by 6, it should have a multiple of 6. So we can take some 6 into some constant d. Now to prove p of k plus 1 is true. For that, we need to write p of k plus 1 expression. That is k plus 1 whole cube minus of k plus 1. We have to prove this is divisible by 6. So, we go for the expansion of this. That is k cube plus 3k square plus 3k plus 1 and minus 1 minus 1. We can cancel these two and we can subtract this. So k cube plus 3k square plus 2k. But from here the value of k cube is 6d plus k. We are going to replace here the value of k cube as 6d plus k then we have 3k square then 2k so finally this is 6d then we have plus 3k square plus 3k and once again, this is 6d plus, when 3 is taken common, we get k square plus k. And this expression is a multiple of 2. So we can verify here. Suppose if I take 1 for k, so 1 square plus 1, which is 2. Suppose if I take 2 for k, 2 square plus 2, which is 6. 4 plus 2, 6. Then 3 square plus 3, so 9 plus 3, 12. Suppose k is 4, so 4 square plus 4, 4 square is 16, plus 4, totally 20. So all these numbers are multiple of 2. So we can replace this expression as some 2 times of some constant m. So we get 6d plus 3 into 2m. Here we can say k square plus k is a multiple of 2. So we can say it is two times of some constant. So finally we get 6d plus 6m and when 6 is taken common we get d plus m. So from this we can say which is divisible by 6 which is divisible by 6 and hence p of k plus 1 is true and p of n is true for all n belong to natural number by principle of mathematical induction.